As the lawsuits pile up, ethical questions are being raised over the actions of a state senator whose law firm could also represent victims of the wildfire. Lynn Kawano has more on why Senator Gil Keith Agaron could be forced to make a tough decision soon. Policy experts say the issue isn't cut and dry, and the sheer scope of the potential legal cases could be a factor. State Senator Gilbert Keith Agaron's picture was prominently placed in a social media ad by a law firm inviting Lahaina fire survivors to community discussions. Agaron is also a practicing attorney, and some have questioned the use of his image. Although it doesn't have solicitation type uh, language, it has solicitation type connotation to it. Subsequent flyers for more recent meetings do not bear his picture. Agaron, the senator, represents parts of Maui and is the vice chair of the powerful Ways and Means Committee, which could be key in rebuilding efforts. If Agaron, the attorney, ends up representing fire victims in a lawsuit, that could put him in a position where he'd have to choose between constituents and clients. Lawmakers can sue the state. We've had plenty of legislators who've sued the state in the past. This is likely to be a massive lawsuit. We don't know exactly who's being sued aside from um, Hawaiian Electric. So, um, you know, the state hasn't been named, um, but I think that there could be potential concerns. Because he's a state senator, he may be privy to confidential information that the public doesn't have, and he might be privy to use that information for the benefit of his client. The Ethics Commission administrator could not comment if an investigation was underway, but rules relating to conflict say legislators cannot represent someone in a transaction involving the state if the legislator has or will participate in work to secure passage of a bill, obtain a contract, claim, or other transaction or proposal. I don't see an immediate problem anyway. If the Ways and Means Committee was holding a hearing on this topic somehow, and he felt that he needed to recuse himself and not participate, I'm sure he would do whatever was the legally and, and the ethically correct thing. I don't see that there's a clear ethics violation here, um, but I think it's incumbent upon the senator to be very, very careful. I think he would be wise to ask for an official opinion from, from the Ethics Commission. We did offer Senator Agaron a chance to comment on the issue. We have not heard back. I'm Lynn Kawano, Hawaii News Now.